Hi everybody. It's uh, six o'clock on the first morning of my uh, trips back onto the uh, airfield lake. I didn't get here until uh, dusk last night. I managed to get one rod out in the light and the other rod just flicked it out, found a sensible area, clipped it up and put it back out. There's a few fish crashing around last night in the general vicinity. Unfortunately no joy for me at the moment. But this is a uh, very funny lake because basically we've not been fishing here since October. So from October through to where we are now in March fish have to uh, survive on naturals, to try and wean them back off naturals and get them used to seeing bait again. It does seem to take a little bit of a while. But hopefully I've got a few plans up my sleeve this year and get them all back onto the bait as quickly as possible and uh, start catching a few carp. I think they have a good look round the water which I'll have to do over hopefully back on Saturday so should get a good little look then. Just have to see how we go and see what uh, work's been done over the winter. A few photographs posted by the estate, what they've been up to. It's be nice to just kind of have a look, check it out, and see how we get on really. Oh, there you go. First morning, back on the lake. Swim does give you a lot better access to the island now. Previous to this, in fact, we have a car from way over to the right and way over to the left, so this is definitely going to give you a lot more access to that island. What depths we've got out there, I don't know yet. There's a kingfisher, which we'll uh, discover as uh, time goes by. So I shall feel I'll be bringing me marker float out next trip. We'll just see how we get on. Anyway, I need to head off, get home, sort the kids out. And do a bit of gardening, and I shall catch up with you soon, everyone. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, and uh, we'll see what this season brings on here. Bye bye now.